How's it going, everybody? All right. Really excited today. We're going to get into a couple of cool expressions. Well, one anyways, for sure. Um, these are expressions that are brand new to the BC market, being distributed by Truth Malters, and very, very excited to get into this. So, <clears throat> High Coast Whiskey is a Swedish whiskey distiller. Very, very cool. Previously known as Box Whiskey, uh, found in 2007. So, they're a relatively new distiller, distillery, and they rebranded themselves in 2018 to High Coast Whiskey. And these folks make some really, really cool whiskey. They're very passionate about quality and flavor and have some adopted some really cool techniques from different parts of the world to really allow them to make excellent whiskey. So we have two expressions available in BC. Today we're gonna kick us off getting into the High Coast Cinco. Very, very neat little whiskey here. This particular expression of whiskey spent its time in five different sherry casks fino oloroso amontadillo paro cortado and px so it's got a lot of beautiful flavors coming out of this expression that i'm really excited to do a live tasting with you guys today on and uh, of course as i always do get you some formal tasting notes out after the fact all right so on a color standpoint definitely a nice color on this one not as deep as some of the sherry ones that i see a little bit uh more like a deep gold not quite as dark but uh, that's okay um high coast does not do age statements <clears throat> very common with many uh, distillers that are located in different regions around the globe outside of you know Scotland and Ireland where age statements are obviously very prevalent um, because of the very cold winters and the very hot summers and all the extra expansion and contraction of the liquids uh, things age a little bit differently at the high coast distillery so no age statements that does not mean the whiskey is good or bad that only means how long it's sat in a barrel they prepare their whiskey and bottle it when it's ready and they do a great job of that. So let's get into this one. Let's check the nose. Ooh, beautiful nose. Wow, this one is very, very sweet. Lots of uh, red fruits, sweet fruits, almost. Oh, what am I picking up here? Like uh, sweet cherries. Definitely some caramels and some typical kind of vanilla notes. Honeys. Ooh, very, very sweet. Almost almost apple juice in there. Um, yeah, beautiful. Almost a little bit of white wine in there too, ironically. But very, very sweet nose. Definitely uh, calls for a taste and to see what you get on the palate. Very, very smooth whiskey. Uh, should note that this is a 50% ABV, so it is a... A little bit stronger than your typical whiskey. Incredibly smooth for that um, <clears throat> ABV. Lots of sweetness on this one, even on the palate. Same thing from the nose. <clears throat> Lots of sweet fruits, um, red fruits, like berries and cherry. Definitely got like nice honey. Um, kind of vanilla buttery vanilla yeah some of those sweeter notes from some of the sweeter uh sherries that are that are with this uh this that <laughs> the whiskey has been spent its time in casks if i could speak but yeah really uh really nice and beautiful whiskey i mean this one's pretty complex there's kind of a lot going through here um but it's very delicious and i'll get you guys some full tasting notes here soon cheers <laughs> 